Yeah, you haven't seen a whole bunch of them. He's a true sophomore, and they didn't play many games last year, trying to get some depth, you know. Um, but I think, you know, again, I've said Michael comes from a family of, uh, of coaches. You know, he was a quarterback in high school, taught by his father. You know, Frank Rocco does a great job up there at the school. Um, and there's a, there's a calmness about him. You know, there's, a, there's a, an understanding about, you know, about the offense, about the style of offense that we have about how to distribute the ball, you know, to the different playmakers. Um, you know, a pocket guy that can, you know, make some of the reads. And so um, over the course of camp, he just kept demonstrating his ability to do that. And uh, as I said before, you know, um, we, we try to simulate live rushes and things like that. But, uh, you know, the, the, the test will come, whether it's Michael or, or, or David or, or Ross, the test will come when, when they're going to come after you and you have to do something. You have to make the snap snap judgment decisions, you got to make those throws, or maybe your feet can get you out of, out of trouble. And um, so we'll see what happens with those guys as, as, as the season goes on. So we're looking at this as this is the first game, but there's still, for, for Rocco and Watford, and, and, you know, and Michael Strauss is also a, a, a good, good prospect. It's going to be a really good young quarterback. But as the season goes on, their development will be crucial, will be key, um, you know, because there is no other else place to go. You can't go to the waiver wire or anything like that. You have to develop the guys that you have, and, and that's what we're going to do.